I have never been tied to someone. Okay. Yep. So there's not been any monetary reason for me to endorse Scentlock other than it works and not paying attention to wind is a major thing. Okay. But I can't say that for 2022 because Scentlock, I, uh, I kind of teamed up with them last summer and I went in there and designed a, it's going to be a Johnny Burhart signature Scentlock suit for 2022. Uh, and it's going to be primarily designed for saddle hunting. So the pockets are going to be a little bit higher on the jacket, uh, knee pads. How cool is you know, that? Built-in built knee pads. Props to Scentlock uh, for picking up on that and doing something doing something right there. The first time they've ever did a signature suit for anybody. That's very so, cool. Yeah, uh, man. And I, I'm very geeked about it, and it's, uh, it's a very unique suit. Have you actually got your hands on it, and you're like, yes, this is, this is right? I was there yesterday. Oh, very cool. They're holding meetings. They got like 10 people, 10, 12 people in this conference room. They're old, they're looking at all their new 2022 <laughs> prototype products. I was in a different room with the guy on mine. And yeah, it's, can, can it's, you, uh, it's pretty close to exactly what I want. Can you yeah. tell us uh, like any of the attributes of that suit that's unique to, you know, like a standard scent lock suit? Uh, the leg pocket designs are different. It's going to have a two-way zipper. So the zipper oh. will zip up from the bottom as well as from the top down. Mm. Uh, obviously, knee pads in the pants that are permanent. Um, it's going to have, uh, the pants are going to have a little ride up thing in the back. So mm -hmm. your jacket's going to override that, you know, on, because it's a scent control piece. Uh, collar is going to be a little bit unique. It's going to have a three and a half, four inch collar in the back, but it's going to taper under your ears and it's going to be really short in the front because as a bow hunter, you're always turning your head. Yep. And these collars these guys make nowadays, they put yeah. everything's got a collar. And always in the way. Down. Yep. Yeah. It's always in the way. So it's really, it's only an inch short in the front. Um, it's going to have plenty of room in the arms for, you know, layer garments. Mm -hmm. So it, it's going to be a piece. It's going to have a little bit of thin slit in the body of the suit. Um, and the pants, even though it's going to have belt loops, it's going to have a cinch tie, a cinch pull in the front, mm. like you'd have on a backpack show, you know, backpack strap. Oh, cool. So it's going to be, you put the damn things on, you button it up in the top and then you just grab that. Cinch her down. Cinch her down. Very or cool. you can use a belt. So it will have belt loops, but there's going to be no reason to need, it, need a belt. Yeah. yeah. Um, uh, there's no butt pockets because you can't access a butt pocket when you're in a saddle anyway. Yeah. So that they're not going to be there. Um, it will still have the little hole in the back in case somebody wants to wear it in a tree stand. Yeah. You know, for, for safety, safety harness. Mm -hmm. uh, that's some of the stuff I can think of. Uh, cool. Do, did they tell you or do you know what patterns, camo patterns it's going to be in? or be in real tree extra. Okay. I wanted, I wanted it to be, I, first off, I wanted it to be. They didn't give you what you want? They didn't. This no, is the this is the John much. Everhart signature series we're talking about here. <laughs> that I we'll go that back into man. <laughs> I wanted either real free escape or Paragila. Yeah. And uh, and it costs like twice as much for the family. So they That's not your you problem. Know, That's Satlock's problem. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like somebody well, else had to figure that out. Down, so the retail wasn't so high. Yeah. So uh -huh. um and, and in reality, I mean Patterns are patterns, and they look good cosmetically. Yeah. I love that Terragila, and I love the new Real Tree Escape that came out last year. Um, but typically, in a saddle, at least for me, I'm hunting at a height where camel's not that big a deal, and I'm always hiding behind trees anyway. I think ultimately, like good hardy apparel that it, you know is is built for you know pocket access the right way that you want. It's way more important, probably. Well, take me. Take me on down the river with a kill.